Welcome. <laughs> this is the energy vibration reading for the Virgo Sun Moon Horizon sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful like, shares, and support. Um, this month of April, we are going to be looking at. Let's see what's coming out for the month of April for the Virgo Sun Moon Horizon sign. Please like, share these videos. The Moon reading is all up, so check out the Moon readings, and then the Love readings is going to be coming up in the weekend. Okay. So let's see what's happening for the Virgo Sun Moon Horizon sign in April. There is a judgment call that is coming up. So um, expect a new, so that's a water energy. Then we have victory and success that is also coming in. This is, is um, very wonderful with the lovers. Um, very, very positive energies. The end of a relationship or changes in a relationship okay so we're gonna go in and look at a relationship something that is happening so let's see so for you guys we have a water energy of a judgment in the first week okay so there is news that is coming in in the second week we have the energy of our movements and the energy of the lovers in the third week so there is water, um, fire, water, and water, okay? So there is definitely a transformation that is coming in in the third week, okay? So we're going to be looking up to see what is this transformation is all about. Now, what is this is saying? There is going to be some victory and success with relationship, with um, contracts, with other people in love. There is definitely going to be some victory and success. So that is good to know what is going to be transpiring the energy of the love and transformation some transformation is coming in in relationships so let's see what's happening with judgment and the um the chariot now this is good whatever the financial situation is judgment and the chariot is here and it's going to be very very wonderful whatever the situation that is playing out whatever that is coming out your financial stability is going to be changing and it is good the energy of uh, um, um, the chariot and the ace of swords is going to be a success. So some of you could be having um, some relationship problem. It could be with a family member or it could just be with um, someone who you know, um, some um, situation that was transpiring. Um, you're going to be victorious over this situation. So it could be that you and a family member, whatever the situation is, you're definitely going to be um, justified and successful over whatever the transition is. Okay. The love is and the transition, the energy of the devil is here. So whatever the situation is with the energy of the lovers, there's definitely, definitely a transition that is coming in. There is going to be um, interception of a, a um, situation outside of your relationship. So whatever that is there and whatever that is transpiring, there is definitely going to be some transition with relationship that is going on. The energy of this situation, there is a lot of information that is coming at you. It could be information, but it also could be speed. Everything is going at speed. Everything is just speeding up. Everything is going at speed. So it's going to be in the second week speed that is coming in. In the third week, we have a situation with a Knight of Cups. Whoever this person is, it could be your son. It could be someone you're in a relationship with. It could be a brother-in-law. It could be a brother. It could be um, an ex-partner or that sort of a thing. Whatever the situation is, or whatever is transpiring, you're definitely, definitely going to be receiving um, some news um, about this person or from this person. Now, this person is a, a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion between the ages of 18 and 45. Whatever the transition is, obviously, this person is connected with some of you as a child, um, as a brother, um, or a sister uh as a, a relationship whether a man or uh, or a woman a feminine or an, an uh, or a, a man energy the outcomes is going to be there's going to be a lot of opportunities that is coming up for you whatever the transition is whatever that has transpired there is going to be a lot of opportunities that is coming up for you i'm seeing the energy of the nine of pentacles so 
your financial stability is going to be good remember that this reading is a reading that is um, a hour long and uh, you're going to be having 15 minutes on YouTube and then all, uh, other 15 minutes this is really really positive um, this is going to be a very positive month for you guys especially with relationship and that sort of a situation some of you could be um, definitely there is the devil that is that is there is in um, influence from outside that is coming in between you and a family member or just you and someone okay so there is definitely some influence that is coming in and this you are going to be seeing this transformation that is definitely definitely going to be happening so whatever the situation is and whatever that is transpiring there is definitely going to be some changes um, financial stability is going to be coming in but we have um, outside influence that is coming in between some of you and your relationships so you need to be aware of this the energy of the four of Pentacles is that you're holding on on what you have you're trying to balance out situations in your life and really hold on to what you have so that you can make your life much easier and this is going to be good because whenever these energies comes up which is very powerful there's going to be a judgment call over your financial um, stability and uh, the energy of the eight of ones is here again financial support is going to be coming in for a lot of you guys so whatever that is transpiring and happening um, a lot of financial stability is going to be coming in for you guys and this is going to be um, extremely good whenever we see the energy of financial stability for the family that is coming in the universe is saying you know um, be ready for what is coming up because uh, something beautiful is about to take place if you were having some unbalanced situation in relationships or in your life well, what is definitely going to be happening is that the balance there is going to be balance coming up for you um, some of you could be having conflicts with your parents um, that is uh, um, uh, something that you should be aware of it could be conflicts with your partner your wife or husband or long-term relationship that you're in um but whatever this situation is and there is going to be a miraculous um transformation that is definitely going to be coming in there is definitely definitely going to be a miraculous transformation that is going to be coming in so um it's a wonderful month and uh, um whoever plays the role of the Pisces, cancer or scorpion love is the only thing that exists and as you realize this and you stand up for um whatever is transforming you're going to be realizing that there is a lot of others opportunity or people out there who would want to connect with you okay so whatever has transpired you virgos are going to be realizing that life is about to shift for you but it's going to be shifting in a very very wonderful way okay um so let's look and see um because um definitely there is going to be some um situation that has to do with your financial uh stability but a lot of opportunities are going to be coming in the center of um, the month that is going to affect most of you is communication communicate very clearly there is a sense of some of you are going to be feeling bonded on things you could be um, feeling bonded on things situations around you or feeling bonded on someone um, some of you are going to be definitely communicating clearly with a person that is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion however this person play a role in your life whether it's um, someone from um, a friend or a good friend however this person play a role in your life what is going to be transpiring is that you are going to be communicating clearly to this person and some of you could be helping this person out of whatever situation they're in but definitely communication and I'm seeing a lot of communication a lot of you are going to be communicating um, between yourself and uh, 
um, it's as if uh, um, if you're in a, a soulmate relationship or a twin flame relationship, because a lot of you are going to be in soulmate and twin flame relationships. Now, what I'm seeing is that there is going to be a transition. There is going to be um, something um, from outside that's going to be influencing your relationship. So you need to be aware of this. Okay, the judgment call for pentacles and the knight of pentacles. You have um, come out of a situation. Have faith because um, finally you have come out of this situation, and this is going to be wonderful. So whatever the situation is and was that was plain, you have definitely come out of this situation feeling very big to um, emotional. Um, there is going to be a lot of emotional situation, a lot of communication with someone, a lot of. Uh, um whatever is happening the second week and the third week is going to be very good okay so for you guys even though the second week is a fire week where there's a lot of, pa of passion there's a lot of movement there is fast movement that is going to be happening in the second week and it has to do with your financial stability and that sort of a thing the energy of the lovers and the debt the transition of the devil because there is the major or color that is coming up and it has to do with a past life situation some of you if you had some health problems this is going to be ending if family have some health problems this is going to be ending listen to your intuition because the energy of the moon secrets some of you are going to be finding out secrets about family friends or your partner um, or um, um, Relationship-wise, you're going to be finding out something. Now, there is definitely peace is on the horizon. So in the second week, definitely peace is going to be coming in for you guys, and this is going to be good. So expect that a situation, you're going to be receiving a lot of information, and you're going to be realizing that peace is coming in for you. Wow. Okay. You Virgos. Oh, my God. Success success the energy of the sun so whatever um situation that was playing out in your life there is definitely going to be a successful outcome to a situation that was playing out in your life and this is going to be good because you have become very successful some of you who were having a situation with a pisces cancer or a scorpion you're going to be very 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 successful um with the situation whatever the situation is or was um if you were having conflicts it would your relationship was of balance and that sort of a thing you're definitely going to be bringing back balance in your relationship and not only bringing back balance but there is going to be a lot of um, clearing that is going to be happening okay there is a lot of offers that is coming up but a lot of jealousy a lot of offers that is coming up but a lot of jealousy a lot of people are going to be very very jealous um, so you need to be aware of this and with the jealousy comes some deception with the deception this is going to be um, ending and a resolution is going to be coming out so whatever that has been transpiring there was some lies jealousy and deceitfulness and um, there was some deceptiveness and it was the end of a situation and with this end of the situation if there comes uh, uh, deception with lies and deceitfulness and it was a karmatic situation that is going to be ended beautiful so um, that is good for you Virgos is really a wonderful month for you Virgos whatever you decide to do in this month go ahead and do it because uh, definitely you are going to be a uh, be um, aligned with the right um, energies and the right positive energies that is definitely going to be coming up for the extended of this reading please pick up the X <laughs> the extending of the reading now we are working with the animal spirit guide as I've said to you guys that in this uh, uh, year we're going to be working with the animal spirit guides and we have two energies that come up and um, card one and card two and whatever is transpiring is that there is a lot of clutter a lot of you have a lot of clutter that needs to be um, released the energy of the frog spirit clear out the clutter the energy of the frog spirit clear out the clutter whatever is going on around you for the people who have chosen card one call upon the frog spirit to clear away the clutters around you 
The second card, your number, for the people who pick um, number one, your number is uh, um, number 10, the Wheel of Fortune. There is going to be some success success in relationships, success over negative influences uh, um, that has come in your life. What I'm saying is that whatever the situation is that has transpired with you and the loved one, um, there is a transition that is coming in. Now, the energy of the pig is here, and the month is the month of justice, and the energy of the pig is here, and it said, use your mind wisely. Use your mind wisely. So do not sit and use your mind to do just think, just dumb things. Try and be very creative if you can, or come up with something. 11, 4 plus 11. Number four is good. Number seven is good. Number four is that the angels and guides are protecting you. Number seven is that you're on the good part, the, the, the correct part in your life, using your mind wisely. So whoever chooses the number two card, it is the energy of uh, the pig spirit. And that spirit is going to be bringing in positive, positive energies and positive vibrations, okay? We're also going to be looking at the activation. And... Um, the activation is that a lot of us need to be activated. Light workers are already activated, um, and that's why we find our gifts. But sometimes we have to use it to activate certain things that is uh, um, not activated by us. And you guys have a beautiful energy that comes up. It is again the number seven. So a lot of you, whatever the transformation is, whatever that is clearing up in your life, it's going to be good. Transformation is air number 43. The frequency of transformation support deep on this to express our feelings. So, this is wonderful and this is good because whatever the situation is, whatever that is transpiring in your life, there is definitely, definitely, definitely going to be some transformation in relationships. And these are going to be um, extremely good. So, whatever is happening in relationships in your life in this month. You're going to be very successful. Peace is going to be coming in, and peace brings a lot of success for most of you guys. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back, and thank you for the wonderful likes, shares, and support. Please remember to cross watch and subscribe. It's very important to subscribe. If you want to pick up the extended of this reeling, please use the, um, the link below, and I will see you guys next month. Namaste.